Hi, my name is Nancy Cashin. I'm the Director of Nursing and Interprofessional Practice at the IWK. This month, we mark what would have been Florence Nightingale's 200th birthday. As well, 2020 is the International Year of the Nurse and the Midwife. I recently read a book on Nightingale's leadership. The book noted how she did not receive enough praise on how she transformed nurses to take ownership and accountability of the profession. She was able to create ownership by engaging nurses to influence the improvement of patient outcomes. And this is where our profession really began to take root. The historical contribution of nurses towards prevention, treatment and control of communicable diseases is well documented. Nurses have been seeing opportunities where others have seen barriers for over 200 years. Today, we see nurses practice in many different environments, fulfilling roles in education, public health, global health, acute care, and long-term care. These nurses have achieved improved health for people by being engaged in influencing the healthcare system on all levels. The Nursing Now campaign from the World Health Organization has five focus areas that I feel set the stage for nursing in the present and into the future. The key areas are ensuring nurses have a voice in healthcare policy making, encouraging greater investments in the nursing workforce, recruiting more nurses into leadership positions, conducting research that determines where nurses have the greatest impact, and finally sharing of best practices. We see all five of these foci daily at the IWK. The past weekend, I read an article from a British newspaper that suggested this time we find ourselves in now to be a pivotal point in history where the world will change. We will continue to see nurses interacting with healthcare systems in new ways as they connect with people to strengthen health outcomes. Today, one in eight nurses were born or trained in a country other than where they currently practice. Global health is becoming a greater responsibility of each country as the world battles challenges with equity in medicine, vaccines, treatments, and education. Our leadership recognizes the wonderful achievements nurses have made and continue to make every day at the IWK. I want to thank you all from the bottom of my heart. Your hard work, dedication, and passion has not gone unnoticed. The willingness of our nurses to take on new roles, volunteer in new environments, and provide care for all people is truly inspirational. But I ask you to remain engaged, to take on the new challenges that will face us. It'll be through engagement, owning the contributions nursing can make, and leading the changing environment that we will continue the legacy Florence Nightingale once we can. Thank you. Get it to stop. <laughs>